In this video, we are going to take a look at how to retexture the Freightliner M2 Ambulance mod from GTAinside.com into a SWAT truck. I am going to assume you already have created a folder containing the DFF and TXD files for this mod. Start by opening the TXD file using Magic TXD. This mod in particular has a lot of textures, but we only need one. Extract Remap Ambulance as PNG. Open the image using your image editing software of choice. In my case, I am using Paint.net which can be downloaded for free. When modifying a texture it's always a good idea to test which area of the texture is used on what part of the model. I have already created a guide layer that tells me where to paint. Turning this ambulance texture into a SWAT truck texture should be fairly simple. Add a new layer and make the background a dark gray color. Move the original image to the top and adjust its transparency. This makes it easier to see what changes we need to make. Add a new layer and create your stripes. For the sake of the length of this video, I will create a straight stripe using a few box shapes. I am duplicating the blue stripe to then create the background colored stripe. Using the magic wand tool I can quickly select the new stripe and pull its handles to extend the second stripe. If you pay attention to the text in the bottom left, you will notice it tells you the width and height of your shape. I use this to know how far I should pull the shape handles. The same is done for the third stripe which in this case is white as seen on the reference image. Add a new layer for your logos. In my case, I got a logo from LAPD. I am placing the logo below the original, due to the emergency light placement. Add a new layer for your text. Let's add our department name on our front, sides. Add a new layer for a flag. I got a flag from Wikipedia. When you are finished, replace the texture in the TXT file with your custom design. Compressing the image in DXT1 should be fine. 